Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Checking in on XLK, Apple, and Facebook. So we had five green, actually we had six days in a row with higher lows on this bounce, and that has now broken. So we are consolidating just under this all-time high. So that all-time high is 64.77. We formed a lower high at 64.46, and now we're pulling back. We're going to look for a healthy higher low. The first support is going to be the daily middle Bollinger Band. If that level breaks, looks like we have a little gap here at 63.42. It's only a gap by a couple pennies, but that would be our next target if we lose this middle Bollinger Band. Healthy consolidation and then a break to all-time highs would give us a bullish MACD cross. The weekly chart is a bull flag. Breaking to all-time highs would confirm that bull flag. And we certainly have a lot of strength and momentum from this bounce, making it all the way back just shy of that all-time high. So the tech sector strong. Apple seeing an upper wake of profit taking the last couple of days. Middle Bollinger Band support. Bulls want to hold that on this back test. We broke the lower high pattern. Now we need to continue forming higher lows and higher highs. 173.54 and 175.50 are the next two resistances. Middle Bollinger Band is 171.49. And then the next level is 168.79. Weekly time frame, still a potential bull flag, holding exponential support. Just need follow through next week and a new all-time high, the sooner the better, to give this a nice bull flag finish. Must hold support in the short term is now 166.46, as that is our higher low after a month of consolidation from the all-time high. Facebook on the daily time frame, big bull day today, break of the inside bar, but couldn't hold on to those gains, and we do have a big upper wick of profit taking. So the bull break on the inside bar was 179.16, and we got follow through there, but we couldn't hold it. So we do still have some higher lows. I'm looking at 177.68 and 177.25 as a couple key support levels. And in terms of this trend, we have our all-time high, low of the pullback, lower high, higher low is now at 176.60. So the bulls really need to hold that level to keep full control on this daily chart. And we look at the weekly chart for Facebook, it's certainly strong. Inside bar is going to form this week, and we'll watch for a break of this inside bar next week. Still watching the middle Bollinger Band is must-hold support and upper Bollinger Band key resistance, which has rejected the price the previous three weeks in a row. So overall, the tech sector is still strong. We're getting some initial signs of consolidation. No red flags whatsoever at this point. We're looking for higher lows to be established. Amazon and Google and other names are pretty close to that all-time high. So keeping an eye on the tech sector, and it would require XLK breaking down on significant bear volume, heading back down towards the low 60s in order to have any concern. So I appreciate you watching and we will see you over the weekend.